How's it going guys and welcome back to a brand new Pokemon Sun and Moon episode and as you can tell this is a brand new session of recording Pokemon Sun and Moon. My voice is a lot better than it has been previously although I'm not completely out of the woods just yet but thank you all for all of your birthday wishes, get well soon messages and also your continued support on this series. I do appreciate every last bit of it but here we go we're back again just before the second trial at Brooklyn Hill. So let us go and see what's going to be going on. Um, is there anything over here, actually? No. There isn't anything over here. Okay, so. Uh, Brooklyn Hill. Uh, a designated trial site for an island challenge. So. Let's just go. Let's just do it. Brooklyn Hill. Oh, hello. Hi there. Oh. Hello. I'm Lana. I serve as the captain of Brooklyn Hill. You look like an able-bodied trainer. Can I ask for your help with something? Uh, sure. Uh, then please follow me. This way, please. Okay. Uh, let's see what's up ahead. Um, I can see what's up ahead, sure. Cheer. <gasps> Ooh. There's a nest ball. There's a fisherman. Ah, oh, XP. Let's get some XP while we're out here. We've got our new... We did catch a... For, is it Formantis? A Formantis at the end of last episode, which we did call Prisma. Um, I didn't actually do a team recap. I might do that in a moment. So, we can try and level up this Formantis. Here we go. Prisma. The one and only. So, I do want to try and get this leveled up. Level 34, I do believe it evolves. So, we've got a little while to go. But it shouldn't be too bad. And, oh, a bad boy is using water gun on us. Okay. Of course, we've got Grubbin, which we do need to get up. We can actually get that to evolve soon. Um, it can evolve at the moment, but I do want to wait until level 25, I think I said. So, we're going to wait till level 25 to evolve that. And then I'll get one of my friends to actually get it to become a, a Vicar Vault for us. But anyways, Leafage again. It looks like uh, Prisma here is on par with a lot of the mons. That did a lot more damage than I was expecting. I don't know what's better. Is Razor Leaf better? Oh, you had to. You just had to. Wow. What a jack. Let's see. Prisma is confused and he breaks through. Good job, Prisma. I really like this Pokemon. I really, really do. But there we go. Sure, let's care for it. Sasha. Oh, Sasha is our rock rough, by the way. Oh, you're a little bit wet, are you? Let's get the hairdryer out. I mean, don't a grass type like water, so shouldn't we really need to not be doing this? Oh, hey, you cute little Fomantis. Hey, full of hearts. You'll be getting boosted EXP soon. Let's give you a green one. You are a grass type. I don't know what they symbolise, but I just do them based off type or colour or whatever they are. I don't know. Nice. So we spoke to him. He's battled us. There's nothing else up there. Uh, let's just quickly heal up the little one. Um, I've only got super potions, so we'll use those. I don't like these flashing uh, icons. Oh, hello. I wonder what we can get in Brooklyn Hill. Can we get anything new here? I'm interested to see if we can get anything new. Oh, Wingles. Woo. Okay, I'm not too thrilled about Wingles. Not too thrilled about those, so let's run away. Could it not? I just want to run away. Could you not? Just leave me alone, please. Pretty please. Pretty please. Pretty please, with a cherry on top. Thank you very much. I don't want to fight any of you. If there is any wild Pokemon here, you guys will let me know. Oh, hello. Lana's here. See? Do you see that there? Oh, what's this? Look at that vigorous splashing. 
I wouldn't be surprised if I find a fearsome Pokemon that is uh, one causing it all. So, brave trial goer, could I ask you to go out there and investigate the splashing there and find out exactly what is causing it? Uh, I won't ask you to swim out there, of course. I'll loan you a gift instead. <gasps> we got a Lapras on the pager. That's awesome. If you climb atop a Lapras here, you'll be able to travel bodies of water. That's right, you'll be able to reach those splashes and see what is going on over there. There are some trainers around here though, so... Oh, is she a trainer? I think she is, because when you get close to them, that's when you know it does that. So let's fight these trainers first, because it is going to be good e uh, EXP. I think, I think I know what this trial is. I think I know what the splashing is. So this is going to be very interesting to see if I can actually beat it. That is going to be interesting. Anyways, we got a Fletching. I didn't even think. This is a Fletchindo. X and Y Pokemon. That's the first. Let's go out to Rock Rough here because you are a Flying type and you become a Fire type, but you're not quite Fire type yet. So, you are at a major disadvantage. However, my Rock type Pokemon over here, my Sasha the Rock Rough, Sasha the Rock Rough over here is going to use Rock Throw. If he was a fire type, well, oh, we're going to miss. That's what's going to happen. We're going to miss to start off with. And, and we're going to miss again. What is with the missing? Does having increased speed mean you can dodge me more? I don't even think so. I don't even think so. Anyways, there we go. Ah, uh, wasn't even a one shot. Tackle's more accurate, so we'll go with tackle. That does a lot more damage to me than I thought it would, considering I'm a rock type. You don't look like a rock type, though. I will care for you. Okay, come on, then. Let's care for you. I only do it for the boosted XP. That's literally the only reason. Uh, I don't need that one. That's the only reason. Well, why is it always you that gets covered in mud? Or dust? Whatever you want to call it. Here we go. Okay, chill out. I went to pat you on the head, but it became a poke. There we go. Oh. He really likes us. I think that's where you get boost XP. I don't know if there's stages of boost XP, but when it does that, that's when you know. It's um getting to like you a lot more. Um uh, let's use our potion. I'm so glad I don't use it on like Pokemon that can't accept it. I'm just glad it had uh, no health missing. Um, so we've got, I think we've just got the one. Yeah, we've just got this one trainer here. And then, hopefully, I really want to see Prisma put in the work here. Because it is going to be a water type. But I don't think she's high enough level. I really don't see her as being high enough level. We've got a Poliswag here. Hello, Poliswag. How are you? It's the first one I've seen, actually. It's the first one we've seen. So, little Poliswag, you're going to get us some decent XP, aren't you? Of course you... Oh, maybe not. Maybe not springs to mind. Um, let us wake up with... Do I have any? And a wake. Here we go. Let's use that, because I want to be wide awake and fighting. It's going to go for Bubble. That's it. Water my Prisma. It needs to grow big and strong. It's probably going to go for another Hypnosis, which I'm not happy about. Bubble, okay. It's going to water us a little bit more. And raise our leave. Ah, oh, bye-bye, Polyswag. Bye-bye, Polyswag. I'm sorry. I'm not going to care. I really want to, though. This care business takes far too long out of the episode. What level are you? I don't think you can evolve yet. Can't evolve just yet. Next level, I think you can evolve. Let's see. Let's see. Let's... Oh, you're just covered in water. I still don't get this. Why would you want to get rid of it? Isn't it nice? It's going to be a while before you get your boosted XP, misses. It's going to be a while. Let's see. 
uh, let me see. What was I going to do? What was I going to do? Oh, I don't need to give you... You're level 23. Okay, so we still need two levels on you yet before you can evolve. Right, let's use the pager. No, that's not who I wanted to use. Lapras. Wow, this is cool. I simply can't set, uh, I simply can't press the curiosity well enough with inside me. That's why I really appreciate investigating those water splashes. In other words, go do it. We wow, this is fast. I'm pretty sure I know what it is. Yep, yeah. they're little ones of the big one. It's the little one of the big one. It's a little wishy-washy. A wild wishy-washy appeared. Is it going to become the big one? I'm pretty intrigued. Like, can I catch this? I wonder if I could catch it. Because I'd love maybe to get a wishy-washy. Let's use it once more. Do I have to kill it or can I catch it? <gasps> Whew, that did too, a lot more damage than I thought it was going to. Oh yeah, I can do the uh, the Y business, can I? Let's go with a Pokeball. Hey, give me a wishy-washy. This would be pretty cool to add. I'm not sure if I'm going to add it to the team. I do want to use it though. Aqua Ring. I would like to use one though. But I already have a water type. This is what I'm thinking. Oh, here we go. A nest ball. Good for water type Pokemon and bug type Pokemon. So it should work better. And there we go. We got ourselves a wishy washy. Wishy washy. What do I call this wishy washy? Hmm. I'm going to call you Shark Bait. Shark Bait. Ooh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Wishy washy is going to be called Shark Bait. Shark Bait. Ooh, ah. Uh. From Nemo, if you don't get the reference. Wishy washy. And your mail as well, that's cool. Shark Bait. Shark Bait. Ooh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. I'm sure it's Shark Bait. Yeah. Shark Bait was added to your pie. Yay. Oh my. So it was a wishy-washy kicking up all the water. Even a little wishy-washy can make such big waves. Splash splash. Oh, was that, was that me? What was that? I can hear some wild splashing over there. Sounds larger than what we saw before. Is it a person or a Pokemon? I suppose we'd had better go and check. Does she want to explain where this splashing is? There's an item here. Oh, hello. Find out the po- Oh, the Poke Finder. We've not used this in a while. Okay, is there no zoom? That's the spirit. I, I really want to zoom in. Can we not zoom? No, we can't zoom. I really wish you could zoom on these things. You could get some really nice ones. Sure, let's do that one. Why not? It's running about. Woo. Lovely. I really like the ones that where you can zoom in. Anyways, let's continue. Do we go down? Wow, wow. 
What did I... Psyduck spawn here then, I'm guessing. Look, there it is. Ah, I'm sorry. What was your name? Oh, of course, it's Brandon. That is a lovely name. Just lovely. Now look up there, do you see that? Whoever is kicking up those splashes must be rather big. A strapping young swimmer, perhaps. Or maybe an amazing Pokemon specimen. In other words, Brandon, please go out there and deal with it. I want... I want... Uh. Is it going to be another Wishy-Washy, or is it going to be the big one? Is it going to be the big Wishy-Washy? Dom, 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 dom. It's a little Wishy-Washy. Hello there, little Wishy-Washy. It's a little one. Let's get some for, uh, some for Mantis levels. Not for Mantis levels, what's he called? Let's get some Prisma levels. And it looks like it only tells you if it's super effective and whatnot if you've actually caught the Pokemon. So that's pretty cool. Anyways, Razor Leaf is enough to knock it out. It's just a little wishy-washy. Prisma gaining some levels. Wants to learn Ingrain. Um, no. No. We don't really need... No, no. I said no. No. I can't just click B. That's annoying. That is annoying just a little bit. Is that good enough? It began to rain. How did you get over here? Oh my. So it was another wishy-washy that was kicking up all the water. How fortunate. It wasn't a strapping young swimmer after all. Splash, splash, splash. Oh my. Now what is that? Even more fear is flashing? It sounds as big as a whale lord. Maybe another Pokemon, but maybe, just maybe, if we're lucky enough to spray a young swimmer. So she wants a young man to be flolicking in the water. Let's go and investigate. One of them's going to be the big, uh, the big wishy-washy. I want to fight you first, sir. Sir, can I get some XP levels off you? So let's fight this person. Challenge by Fisherman Carl. Are we going to get a, um... I hope we get a rod here. I'd like to catch some water type Pokemon at some point as well. I mean, we caught Wishy Washy. Oh yeah, we didn't have a look at Shark Bait. Ooh, that's cool. Now it tells you what the weather's like. I've not seen that before. Oh no! The mighty splash! What on earth will I do? I know, I'll just raise a leaf. I will just raise a leaf. Oh no, another Magikarp. What on earth will I do? I'm pretty sure you can use a Z-Move Splash, which is quite sad. I think he's got Swift Swim as well. I think he has Swift Swim. Wow, even... Leafage is such a slow... Well, not slow, but weak move. It's such a weak move. Hmm. Interesting. I know they did with Splash. I'm not caring for now. Not right now. Let's keep going. Rooklet Hill. Uh, within lies the, uh, lies the legendary Pokemon that is said to be the embodiment of the itself, the mighty Kyogre. That's amazing. It was only a joke, Brandon, but you're rather trusting at wow. What a son of a gun. Well, we're near the sea. If a splashing sound comes from the sea, then I wonder what is causing it. We are very close to the sea, really, aren't we? And now it is raining as well. The rain will boost the power of water-type Pokemon's moves by half again. Could those splashes be caused by some Pokemon whose moves are now growing stronger in the falling rain? <gasps> Possibly. Is that Pokemon holding our hands again? Oh, well, I see a trial site. Brandon, you've come all this way with me. Okay. That's right. Didn't you notice? You passed through the captain's gate by my side. Which means that you will undergo my trial. To claim my trial, you must defeat the great totem Pokemon known as Lord of the Ocean. That spray of water you can see there. That you will probably find the totem. And perhaps those wishy-washy that battled you against. You, uh, that battled against you would also want their revenge. Well, sadly I caught one, so it's not going to be able to get revenge, is it? Defeat whatever comes your way and prove you, uh, proves to me your strength. 
And remember that you cannot catch any of the Pokemon unless here. Catch any of the Pokemon here unless you complete my trial. Let the trial begin. Well, I'm sorry to tell you, but I totally didn't catch a little sharp bait over here. Hi, little sharp bait. Sharp bait. Ooh, ah, ah. Oh, it's a bold nature. It's going to be a tanky one. A tanky little fella. Let me first heal up Prisma. I might use Sharp Bait. I still haven't decided. I'm so glad they've done this so we don't have to... Wait, how far is that? So you don't have to have a... I want to see if there's anything else around here. Anyway, let's go for it. Thunder crashed over the open sea. Lapras is trembling. That's a lot of wishy-washy. The legendary totem wishy-washy. Wishy-wishy-washy. Oh, look at him. He's all orange. Something to do with defense. I missed it. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, it's level 20. Okay. Let's have a look at its... Uh, what's its plus? Um, its defense is up. Rain. Question, what's the... What's the... Rain. The rain condition boosts the power of water. Oh, so rain just boosts water type moves. Anyway, okay. Let's go with... I want to go with growth first. Let's get that uh, special attack and physical attack boost. What did he use? Spray. Ah, oh, I don't get a stab anymore. Called its ally Pokemon. It's going to be another wishy-washy little one, isn't it? It is going to be a little wishy-washy. Wishy-wishy-washy. Um, luckily, Razorleaf heats two Pokemon, so we should be good. We should be able to knock out the little wishy-washy. Aqua ring. Let's see. Bye, little wishy-washy. Wow, those defenses are solid. That guy's defense is... Oh, okay. Whoa. Um, This is going to be interesting. Let's go with another razor leaf. I think that's physical. Razor Leaf is physical, isn't it? That's resisted. Wow. Um, let's just... I'm pretty sure... I think Leafage is physical as well, though, isn't it? Wait. Why have I got a plus? Oh, my special attack went up, didn't it? Um, let's just double check. Summary. Your physical, physical. So it is physical. So you are a physical attacker anyway. Uh, let's up another growth. Oh, let's go razor leaf first. I'm a derp who clicked the wrong move. It's got an berry or something, hasn't it? It's got a citrus berry. That's even worse. Prisma, please live this. Prisma lived. Right, what I'm going to do is, before I set up more, I'm going to switch out into... Ju Ooh, hold on. What are your defenses like? Um, this special defense is pretty okay. Let's go out into our little Neutron over here. Hopefully, Neutron can uh, deal some decent damage to this thing without getting bodied. One more is going to kill me, isn't it? I feel like one more is going to kill me. Survive. So Neutron only gets one hit if I can get a hit off. Let's go back out into Prisma. And let's start setting up though. So we've got a Growl we've removed. So let's go with a Growth. Let's try and get a couple of these up. Because then I should be able to just one-shot it. 
It's going to go for soak, so I lose my stab bonus. Wow, this game is really picking on me. Let's go with another growth, because I've got a feeling it's going to growl me again. Oh, it's not. Oh, it's not. So I know I can select those 20 points of damage, so I can live one more. Let's go with a razor leaf to start with. That should take it. It takes it down to there. I can live this one. Thank you. It's calling ally Pokemon. Is it going to get any more? An Alola Molar. Um. Okay. Let's go with Prisma with a Super Potion. That's interesting. Because those things are annoying. Those things are annoying. Am I going to not be able to live now? That's going to go for Water Gun. It looks like its attacks are a lot higher. Um, but that does 20 points of damage. And this is my last potion. Oh boy. Okay, I have one more. I need it not to attack me. I want Prisma to do... Oh no. How much damage is this going to do? Right, that does far too much damage. I wanted you to get the XP. Right, I'm just going to go for it. I'm going to go for the Razor Leaf and see how much damage I get off. I'm pretty sure I outspeed, right? Okay. That is not what I wanted to see at all in the slightest. Let's get some damage off. It's going to knock out my little, uh, my little guy over here. Sorry, Prisma. I'll recover you. Don't worry. All right, I'm going to use a little shark bait over here as a kind of uh, scapegoat. I'm sorry, little shark bait. I really want to use you, but... Oh, I don't have any... Uh... I thought I had... Did I... Oh, yeah, I do have revives. I want to say I thought I had revives. Uh, let's recover Prisma. So that water gun is going to take... Oh, it might not, actually. No, it does. And he's going to have no target to attack. Uh, let's send out Juvia. You've got the Quick Claw as well. So, this is going to be interesting. Uh, let's go with... What attack moves are boosted in the rain, though? Uh, can I, I can disarm in voice both, but the, it's going to split the... It's going to split it, isn't it, though? Let's get some chip damage off both. Okay, that's fine. Helping hand growl. Not sure what I think about that chat. <laughs> At least they can't use potions. They can't use potions at least. Now, this is what I do. Do I target that thing because it just keeps healing the wishy-washy? And that's what's drawing out the battle, making it difficult. I think I'm going to tag it down that Alola Mola. Right, let's... Oh, that does only does more if you... Right, I'm going to go for Water Gun on the Alola Mola. Let's see how much this boosted Water Gun does. It does do enough to knock it out. That's fine. So, Juvia gets some nice XP there. Prisma doesn't get the level. Sasha gains a level. And here comes the Water Gun. These are ones that are going to hurt. Okay, your special defense is good. Plus, you resisted being a water type. How much does your water gun do on the wishy washy? Okay, so we do about the same amount to each other. But since the. Since this disarming voice isn't split, I wonder if it'll do more. I'm intrigued. I don't know, it does the same amount. But Water Gun does the same amount as well. Right, I can live one more. So let's go for one more Water Gun. It's not very effective. I'm aware of this. But it's the one that does the most. It's Stab. It's in the rain. We're having a Water Gun off here. Let's see. Um, now I need the Potion. I'm going to Potion up Juvia. 
I do want to get. I do want to use a revive on Neutron. I wanted him to get the XP. I really do want him to get as much XP as he can. So we can evolve it soon. That's all plan. But I'm not going to waste one right now. Let's see if we can finish off this wishy washy. Thanks to our glorious little starter over here. Two more. Two more should be enough. He's used his citrus. He's no more alone. Oh, or schooling do. Um, okay, I want to know what that ability does. Please don't tell me it boosts stats. Or does it lose stats? I'm interested to know what that stat, what that does. Who wants to learn Bubble Beam? Juvia wants to learn Bubble Beam. 65, 40. Yeah, let's get rid of that and get the Bubble Beam instead. Because it does more damage. Yeah, go! You defeated Tom Wishy Washy. I'll have to look up that ability. I'm pretty sure. Oh, here we go. Who needs dealing with? I don't know why we're using this to get rid of water off a grass type. Still don't understand. Alright, you're cute. I'll give you a rub on the head. There you go. Was there anybody else that wanted? Enjoyment. Affection. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Have you not been getting any affection? I'll give you some affection. Here you go. There you go. You've had some affection now. <laughs> so easy to please a Pokemon. Anyways. Let's see what they say. The rain has gone. And we have done. What we came here to do. Very well done, Brandon. Please come back this way. That was a kind of... It was difficult, I have to say. It wasn't too easy. I, I must say I, that I find myself at an impasse here. All of the wishy-washy that I so dil diligently trained were up and defeated. But of course, I cannot let uh, your completion of my trial go uncelebrated. You are truly amazing. Uh, you are amazing. Truly impressive. Please take this. What's this? <gasps> the water. Does that mean I can give this now to my... Uh... I can use it on my starter? Do, 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 do. There we go. Not even bad. That's awesome sauce. Do you know what this is, don't you? This is a water room Z. And not that uh, I, and that's not all I can offer you. Here, as um, Alana Original, one of my homemade fishing rods. Hey, there we go. We got ourselves a fishing rod, which we should be able to use. This is my uh, these are racing rod. Oh, she's telling us how to use it. I recommend dive balls. So she give us some dive balls. Isn't she lovely? She's all prepared. Um, did you know that I once reeled in a red Gyarados? Did you really? Well, what do you think? No, you're a lying little son of a gun. You did a fine job today. Shall uh, shall I see you back to the Pokemon Center on Route 5? Yes, please. Good. Let's be on our way then. We can do a spot of fishing later. Next is Kawi. K what is that? Kayawi? Kayawis? I'll call you Kayawis. Next is Kayawis Trail. It takes place on Weller Volcano Park. Oh, and that reminds me. Did you see some Sudowoodoo by the uh, the Pinola Ranch? Um, they were causing some trouble for people. So I gave them a little dose of my sea, uh, sea power using my water MC. Uh, just a little lesson to them. Oh, wonder how they will react when uh, when they see you have a water MC too. Hee <laughs> hee. Does that mean they'll run away from me now? Let's see. Can I give the water MZ to... I sure can. But you can't have the quick plot. 
Holding the water comes in. Let's give it Shark Bear as well. Why not? There we go. So they've all got... I think they've all got one now. I, I mean, I can give Prisma one. She hasn't got anything. There we go. So it's instead of an item, it looks like. But anyways... I'm going to wrap up today's episode right here. I'm going to put the little wishy-washy in the box for the time being. Because I don't think I'm going to use him. Because I already have a water type on the team. But that is going to be it for today. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. And I will see you guys hopefully in the next episode of our Pokemon Sun and Moon Let's Play. See you guys all then.